Oh, right there. That's a bar. I might, yeah. I might use that one. So we got Diddy Kong versus Random. Nah, someone's going up. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. This is the last match on their pool. Uh, on this Player pool. one and uh, and uh, Solo. This is uh, I think this is what's projected. Solo's really really good. Uh, player one is like one of our top players in our state. Yeah. Like people will talk about player one, but honestly, like back in Brawl, he was doing so so good, and then like he was tearing people up in Smash Four and Ultimate. But no one talks about him because like he's just not he's not around. Yeah. He doesn't travel like that. Yeah, he doesn't travel like that. Hey, y'all behave in the chat. Wouldn't that be bad? Wouldn't that be bad? Yeah, yeah. it would be bad. Yeah. I don't even chill, bro. Maybe it's, there's some drugs in here, bro. I don't know. Nah, nah. <laughs> Hopefully not. Yeah. Anyway, Diddy versus Ike. Let's go. I think I had like 10. Yeah. I had like 10 of them. Alright, you gotta chill on that. Uh, hey, shit. shout out to Icebreakers. Not sponsored, uh, but Icebreakers are clean. You know, the little, you know the little sweet icebreakers, man? I, I'm killing them right now. Yeah, no, he's, he's eating a bunch of these. Uh huh. I mean, to be fair, he's got the good flavor, but uh, enough of that right now. Uh huh. So, yeah, uh, dang, bro. Like, 70 already. Honestly, I really like this matchup as Ike. Because, like, once you get your reason, bro, it feels so good. And, like, Ike punished Diddy so hard for, like, you know, like, doing, like, a bad one flip or a bad recovery. But the thing about Diddy is that Diddy is so oppressive in his neutral with a banana and his good buttons. Yeah. Uh, seeing how he does against Ike, though. Oh, yeah, for sure. Like, I don't know how I feel about this match in Ultimate. I, I know I have fun, but I have no idea in terms of the fact of, like, of, like, like how good it is for Ike. Or, like, how good it is for Diddy. Diddy got like some of the best out of shield, man. Oh yeah, for sure. As long as he's got banana in his hand. Yeah, for sure. But the thing about ice out of shield options is that even though they're slow, they kill. Mm -hmm. And all Diddy has to do is miss base one aerial, one uh, one tilt, and it's over. Oh, what a charge. That's another thing too, is like Diddy's like, it, to know like a good Diddy too, is like you, you gotta know how to punish out of shield with banana, but also like you gotta make sure you charge your, your smash attacks out of, as a follow up too. I know I don't get crazy out of grab, but like he should grab him when he shields like that. Oh, 100 percent The thing about I, the thing about Diddy is that Diddy likes to banana shield. Yeah. That's like the best thing about Diddy. Yeah. Like, and like, I mean like granted, Solo took the stock. That's another thing too, is like getting grabs of Ike in this matchup is so key. For yeah. positioning, obviously. Right. Because even though Ike like stops getting follow-ups at like, you know, around kill percent, mm -hmm. like positioning is still just as important. Yeah. Alright, Dead Aid the Legend 2 is gonna happen. Alright, nice patience from Solo, didn't panic. Yeah, he's, he's still in here. And this is where Diddy thrives. Player one is taking all that advantage. You gotta take that was it right a crazy out of bait. He actually read that. All yes, sir. That. that was such a good catch. Missed mm -hmm. fall up there. He's like, yeah, he's gonna commit to something. Yeah, pretty much. Like, at the ledge, Ike doesn't have a lot of options. But the thing is that, like, it, the moment Ike gets right, he gets out for free. But Diddy, Diddy's such a good character at ledge trapping. All right, cool. I don't know if that was on purpose, but that got a lot of damage on him. So, yeah. all right. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, just getting out of there at that situation straight up. That was such a good monkey flip on his, on his, uh, on his part. Air banana. So what, 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 what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Uh, player one's looking for at this point. He's down. He's down a little bit. But honestly, I like he's looking for him to just. Uh, I guess it overcommit or I guess overextend. Yeah. Trying to crack so much pressure on him until he folds. Yeah. You know, Solo's pretty composed. Yeah, that's the thing too. It's like he's getting hit by a lot of stuff, but you know, look at this, the life right now. 
know what I mean? Yeah, that's the thing. Ice heavy, so like, he can take those hits. I think Solo is exploiting Diddy's weakness, which is like, you know, it can be hard to kill. Yeah. Um, so he's like, yeah, I'll take these hits, but like, I can kill you, you know? That's, that's, that's the thing too, is like, that's Ike, the thing that Ike has over uh, Diddy. And that's the, another thing too, Ike has side B. And side B, is a, it, it, it becomes disjointed if you like, let it go at the right time. Right. And it can be so good at zone breaking Diddy and like disrupting his flow. Right. Also, Ike is really good with banana. Like banana by itself is such a good tool, but you give it you give it to a character with disjoints uh -huh. and combos out of like anything, like Nair. Right. And like he can take it so far. Right. So let's see. Uh, they're pretty much even. I know it's 57 on Diddy, but Diddy racks up damage like like that, like that. Like his combo game is insane. Yeah. Oh wow, I don't know what that was. I I think he just wanted positioning. But I mean, like, I, they're like scrambling a bit, yeah. Is that just outrageous order? Uh, that's crazy. My man has a sword. That oh man, that would have been nuts, bro. That's uh, another thing so too. Diddy, Diddy can confirm Nair into a down air at the yeah. ledge. Mm -hmm. Like he's got so many setups, it's actually insane. And look at that, he's being so slippery, trying to just keep, you know, keep out of the way, trying to be careful not to get hit by Ike's, you know, crazy confirmed. Oh, wow, that was scary. And he's reading the high of recovery. That's such a good move. Yeah, he's reading the high of recovery. Yeah, he's just keeping him out. Now, like, what are you supposed to do, though? I know, right? Like, he, he's like, I'm in the lead. I got this. I've got, I'm just going to push my advantage and mess up by letting him get the lead. Yes, sir. And see, like, so he, he can, like, he can mix it up by, like, trying to go center stage, but dang, that charge is gonna take it straight out. Yeah. He definitely, like, just had all of that calculated. Because, like, the way I was looking at it, I was looking at it, like, because we know that I can kill easier than Diddy, but straight up, yeah. at the same time, if Diddy has to lead, bro, he has all this stuff to haul you out. You know, your sword means not that much. Yeah. Like, just because of the name. You're scared to approach because of banana confirms, and it's like, okay, you know, you, have, you don't have as much options. You gotta be so yeah. yeah. So, another thing too to note is that banana's transcendent, and on top of that, he's faster than Ike, so oh, yeah, that, that just too. makes it harder, like, for him to really get something going. True. Yeah. But you know, like I said, it's, it can go either way for either character. Both players seem to have multiple counts of experience, you know, this type of level. So what, make, what makes Diddy so good against sword characters too is that Banana, they changed how it works uh, in Ultimate. Because in, in Smash 4, Banana uh, would clank with like certain moves. Or not clank, but like it would just like lose certain moves. In Ultimate, they made Banana transcendent. So like you throw a move out against Banana, it's gonna go straight through. Yeah. I guess for, uh, against like you know like like uh, normals and like aerials and stuff like that. For projectiles, it's different because projectile and projectile. Um, yeah. But against Ike Sword, Diddy's banana goes straight through. Yeah. Um, Solo is a bit very conservative at the moment, which I don't blame. But it's tough. Like, the things that he's, like, he's losing, so like he's got to like get in. Yeah. He's trying to find where he can get his opening. But if you wait too long, you'll die. Right. So you you want to be quick on your decision making. But I mean, like as a heavy fighting Diddy, you know, like I doesn't really have to worry because I mean, like the only time you're really really losing against Diddy is if like you're losing it, you're like down a stock. Yeah, that was yeah. Or that yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so if you're down a stock, or like if you're getting ledge trapped by Diddy. Solo needs to find a different way to land because like he's been killing him by. Catching his landings, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, he's using side B to mix up. But the thing is, like, player one's catching on to the point where it's just like, okay, you're using side B, but, like, I'm sitting here with banana, and I still got, like, I still got control of my stage. Yeah. Like, look at that. Like, like, so, like, so, he, 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 like, he got to center stage, and, like, he, like, he did an aerial immediately. And player one's like, I'm just gonna wait it out. I don't gotta worry about anything. Oh, what a bait. Now Solo's going 
little too aggressive. For yeah, he's, he, he's panicking a lot. Um, yeah. He's trying to get hits unnecessarily. Yeah, he's got to, like, slow like, down. It's not his turn yet. Right. And the thing is, too, is, like, all he needs to do is just get one confirm and just pull that advantage. But the thing is that he's trying to swing a lot. Yeah. That's the thing about Ike. It's, like, if, if Ike gets pressured and he starts swinging, that's when they start losing. Uh, See, like, right there. Like, I mean, like, sure, he didn't know, like, like that would have been safe. But the thing is, like, you gotta be really, like, careful about how you throw out up as Ike. Or, like, any move in general. Because you can just take a lot. And Player Warren's just running away with this right now, actually. Uh, sure, he can't kill him. But, like, he doesn't have to worry too, too much. Yeah, thing he's at 60, basically. Now he's at 80. Yeah, he, he can definitely kill him. It's like, he just needs to, like, not be so... Uh, I have to make a move. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? Just because... He wants to get that kill off early because he knows he can run away with clean. Honestly, but, I think Solo, like if he if he if he, thought, if he uses advantage up, which he kinda dropped, um, if he kept it up, he could have he could have honestly taken the stock. Yeah. Cause like I, he's got confirmed at hundred from like down tilt and there. To like basically like, kill Diddy. He could have killed him just now, but he didn't know that he would trip off of that. He's gonna do it. Nah, yeah. And Ike's gonna make it back for free. So I'd be so good. I don't know what he's doing. Cause yeah, like Diddy can just do that. Like I don't I was, like come on. Like bro. you can't do that against Diddy. Cause Diddy's just gonna up B right there and just gonna take the stock. I'm, I'm tripping. Like I'm like damn, bro. You gonna re grab three times? And like that's the thing. Most characters can't punish like doing that. Yeah. Like they just gotta hold it. But Diddy, he's got that burst option that can just take him out. Yeah. Well, People forget he, that move yeah. exists. Uh huh. He can just kill. Yeah. I think he's in this. I think. Um, player one, the way he is avoiding solos, like kill confirms and stuff, he's getting in his head. Yeah. Now, now player one's out of like the percentage where like strong hit of there like won't confirm anymore, and um, and down tilt it's gonna be so hard for a solo to confirm anything on down tilt. Like that, yeah. If 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 if, uh, if player one gives him too much space, he could dash attack. Yeah. Right. Eventually, Nair just kills straight up. Yeah. So like you know that's pretty good off. That's pretty good for him. Though. Still up. It's still tough. That could have been downer, actually, from, yeah. uh, from player one, I feel. Uh -huh. See, that's the thing. Side beacon's own break. Mm -hmm. Solo can still do it. He just gotta... Oh, yeah. He has 100%. to make some adjustments. Rage Ike is one hell of a drug. Yeah. Like, he can, like... <laughs> like, he can delete Diddy Kong at, like, maybe, like, around, like, 60%. Just, but the thing is, too, is, like, player one, if he keeps him at the ledge... He can just confirm it to a smash attack out of banana, and that'd be see it. how he's reading him right now? It's crazy. Yeah, his ledge control is so good. That's all gonna get down. Gets hit by the side B. And like, Solo's not scared of dying as much. But he can't let Snowball sm too much, because otherwise, like, we're, we're one minute left on the clock. He's at like, he's getting camped out. I don't know. I don't think it's gonna go to time. But yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> that helps. Uh, so I forget that kill. I forget that kill. Yeah. Well, he could have lived if he had. Yeah. He wasn't ready. That move was fast. Yeah. Really well played by both of them. Though. Yeah. Yeah. There's um. That was the last of that pool. Uh. Yeah. That's the last one for uh. A two. So we're on the last set of pools for us. Uh huh. So, uh, A3. Okay, cool. Right. You know they got some beverages, like drinks. Alright, well, we signing out. Yep. Alright, this has been my boy, T. Neal. Yes, sir. Uh, T. Neal and Matt, you know what's going on. Uh, Y'all can follow us on our socials, too.